Today in English, we'll be reading the story day and night. We know a few rules. We use the pointer finger to point at every word that we are reading. Yes, so please use your pointer finger and read and give the pauses. We know after we finish a sentence, we give a full stop. So don't forget to pause out there. Right children? So let's read the story together day and night. So now we are going to do the 15th story from a story reader today. The name of the story is Day and Night. So let's begin. We all know the rules. We have to use the pointer finger to point while reading. Yes. The sun sets. Four children run towards a huge neem tree. It's story time. What story will Popo tell them today? Popo starts his story long, long ago in the big jungle. There lived many animals. There was no sun for many days. It was very dark. Rabbit could not see. He fell into a deep hole. I need light, Rabbit shouted. No too bright shouted owl on the tree. Rabbit and owl started to fight. More light shouted rabbit. No, no, no shouted owl. Many animals came and sat in a big circle. Fox said, he likes to hunt in the dark. Goat said he needs light to look for grass. Light, 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 said rabbit. No, 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 said owl. Moving on. Now, do not fight said bear. The sun is taking some rest. We will ask the sun to come back soon. Then we will all have light in the day. Rabbit was happy to hear this. It, it will be dark when the sun goes to rest, the owl was happy to hear there will be light. All the children are happy to hear the story. 